This is Dr. Willie Ong. For this video, I would like to give some tips on difficulty of breathing or shortness of breath. This is quite a, a common symptom. I have here a diagram of the possible causes of difficulty of breathing here on the right side and the questions you should ask the patient. For example, if the patient is anxious, his hands are maybe tingling or there's numbness, it could be due to anxiety. So treatment is just towards the anxiety and avoiding stress. In the second situation, if the patient has a history of asthma and he or she has shortness of breath, it can be due to an asthma attack. So you need to see a doctor, go to an emergency room, and if it's an asthma attack, you need to take your asthma inhalers and other medicines. This could be quite serious because there are some young people who have died with an asthma attack. In the third situation, if you have difficulty of breathing, you have fever, cough, if you're expectorating yellow phlegm, it can be due to pneumonia. So the doctor will request for an x-ray and if, and if it's positive for pneumonia, the doctor will give you antibiotics either at home or in the hospital. In the fourth situation, if the patient's a heavy smoker and he has difficulty of breathing, it can be due to emphysema or chronic obstructive pulmonary disease, so you should stop smoking. And uh, in the last two situations, if the patient cannot lie flat on bed, he could have a history of heart disease, there may be leg swelling or not, it can be due to heart failure. So this is also quite a serious condition, and you should also see your doctor, so your doctor will give you medicines for heart failure. As you can see, there are many causes of uh, difficulty of breathing like anxiety, lung problems, heart problems. But as a general rule, you should, number one, stop smoking, avoid secondhand smoke, try to avoid air pollution and air pollutants, and of course, lead a healthy lifestyle. And you should also see your doctor to find the possible diagnosis. I hope my video helps you today. Thank you for watching.